everybody. I hope everyone's doing well. Well, today in this Moving Chronicles a Makeup a Declutter Packing Keeping series, we're going to tackle um, uh, lipsticks and lip liners. I don't think I have a lot of lipsticks. So this is the containers. Um, some of it is um, liners. So this is the containers pretty much where I house the lipstick. And then this is like the lip liners and things like that and tweezers and things like that. So let's see, let's see where we can get, let's see. All right, uh, this is the L'Oreal uh, Infallible Paints Metallic. Uh, I don't, I know my daughter had it and it was brand new. I don't know if one of her girlfriends gave it to her, but like I said, it was brand new and wrapped. Um, but I think she tried it and it's just too much for her. Uh, my daughter really just puts like mascara and then she fills in her brows. But this is how that looks. It's a definite copper. When she first gave it to me and I swatched it, I, I liked it. So I ended up keeping it, but I haven't used it. Let me see what color this is to tell you. I'm gonna probably have to leave my glasses on. Um, this is the 336 Liquid Venom. So there's that one. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it and I'm not gonna pack it. I'm gonna keep it out. I don't think any of my lipsticks I'm gonna pack. I don't know, but we're gonna keep this out and I'm gonna try it and try it. Uh, until the move, I move a March 1st, uh, maybe sooner, hopefully sooner, <laughs> but that's until the day we have. And so some products that I've been decluttering, I've been unsure if rather, whether I want to keep it or not. And so what I've been doing is I've been kind of keeping it out and I'm trying it from here until the move. And once the move comes, either I'm going to pack it because I liked it or I'm going to chuck it because... I don't like it. So anyways, let's move on. This one here is from Clinique, a different grape. I do believe it's Clinique, yes. And I've had this now for a bit. I'm not gonna lie, this is one of my older ones, but oh, I love it. I think what I'm gonna do with this one, look at that, I do, I do use it. Uh, I'm gonna keep it out, I'm not gonna throw it away. And then I think once the move comes, I think I am gonna get rid of it because it is fairly old. Oh, excuse me, I feel like I have a frog in my throat. All right, Wet n Wild, uh, Wet n Wild C504A. <laughs> That's what it has. Um, I think I'm gonna check this. I just barely bought it. I did do a haul for you guys. Um, I did use it like once or twice. I see that frost. I like the frost, but not so much. And I got it at the Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna throw that one away. Uh, I would give it to my daughter, but she, like I said, my daughter is not really into lipsticks. Not really. Um, she likes bomb, like lip balms and things like that. All right, L'Oreal Empress, 53 Empress. Look at that, look at that orange. Um, did I, 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 did I even use this? I don't know. I don't think so. Um, whew. Um, it's, it, it's pushing it. It's pushing it. Recently, I hauled for you guys this one from Flower, Flower Beauty. I don't know. Um, and I had said that I got it off Ulta. And um, look at that. See, it's, it's, this is this one. And that it's not something that I typically would wear out and about. Um, and that kind of falls in line with this one. I mean, I like it, but it's just something I'm going to wear. I don't know. Like at this one, I just bought. What I'm going to do is I'm going to keep it out. We'll do some get ready with me with this one. And we'll see how we feel about it at the end once the move comes around. And uh, that Flower Beauty, I think I paid like $2 and something cents. two seventy, two eighty, dollars something cents. Let's do that with that one. Bite Beauty. Now, I will tell you, pretty much, I do believe the Bite Beauties that I have are old. Uh, they are old. This one is in Vital, and some of them I got in a little set. Um, this one's going bye bye. Yeah, it's going bye bye. I just, yeah, it's going bye bye. It 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 really is old, and as you can see, guys, apparently I just don't even use it. I'm very much, when it comes to lipsticks, just a very more neutral <laughs> kind of gal. Uh, anyways, here's another by Beauty. Uh, Cream Deluxe Lipsticks number 12. Number 12, that's all it says. 
uh, look at that here again here again um, I know I, it, I don't know it's going bye bye it, it's these are old um, all my bite beauties I would say are relatively old some more than others but yeah okay origins another one metallic I think I got this at Marshall's uh, sweet iris number seven <laughs> another metallic um, and it has orange origins there let's see this one here I might have used this one a little bit um, okay I can do this oh it's it's a gloss look at that um, is it what let me let me make sure iris I don't know I can't I can't really read it I'm gonna keep this definitely gonna keep that next we have this one here from who are you from Kat Von D yeah Kat Von D uh, I think I got this in some type of kit or something like that um, that's pretty kind of along some of the other ones what I like about this one though as opposed to the bite beauty the bite beauty one is very very thick uh, and this has a very nice glide to it uh, I'm not a pinky person I don't know I need to stop saying that I'm not a pinky person just neutral because I, I this year I want to discover more color um, and this has a, a pinky tone for sure so let's keep this one a little bit and then again come the move we'll make a determination so so far I'm not keeping anything for sure everything is going to be a try or a trash so far all right all right all right Mac what are you Mac runway hit I think I got this at Marshall's recently recently yes I did and this oh yeah I remember this is a very very matte <clears throat> excuse me very matte I mean almost drying but I think I paired this up with something else so let me put I'm gonna keep this to the side I am gonna keep it um, I, I like the color and I think I recently bought an Anastasia one very similar Let's get that right now, shall we? It's right here. I just bought this re recently, and this is Sedona. I think you've seen the haul. Um, oh my goodness, Laura. You're a definite creature of habit, for sure. This is Sedona, a little deeper, and this is the matte MAC. Or, I'm sorry, it's called, what did I say? Runway hit runway hit Sedona Sedona is a deeper tone and Sedona is also a matte however this one I absolutely love it's not drawing on my lips at all it feels so smooth I'm gonna keep it out but it's an actual keep it's not like let me see if I'm gonna get rid of it no 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 but very similar guys oh let me keep the Mac one on that's the Mac one runway hit okay let me see if I can find oh here it is Burt's Bees, I bought this at Marshall as well. And this one is, uh, is it Burt's Bees? No. It's not Burt's Bees, Laura. It's Becca, Becca. And it was completely sealed, I remember, and I didn't know what I was getting. Like, I didn't know other than the color was Surge. But on the on the container, on the on the carton, it, it didn't have like what type of shade. I just, and it was, I don't know, what was it, like $3, $4? I said, I'm just gonna get it. It was sealed and it was Becca. But I was absolutely very, very impressed. Now, bright for sure. Let me put it with that MAC. But, and let me reapply the MAC because I, I took some of it out. And the runway hit, very drying, very drying. But uh, they are different shades. But what I started doing, I started using these two together. And it actually worked out really, really nicely. This is very sheer, even on the lips. It may not look like on the hands, but it is pretty sheer pretty glossy pretty sheer but it feels really really good so I'm gonna keep these two for sure um, even though this one and Sedona from uh, Anastasia are very very similar but I'll tell you the color is but not the consistency on my lips at all I'm gonna keep how long am I gonna keep this one for for sure throughout the move and more but I, I will revisit that maybe in six months or so and see if I if I've even really pull it all right okay let's move on here we have Lorac. this is an old one siren um i kind of like this um don't pull it out too too much very oh yeah now i know why <laughs> it 
it's just i don't know guys it's too deep too too deep and it's older i'm gonna let it go I'm gonna let that one go it's pretty and i'm sure really neutral eye or something <laughs> excuse me i feel like i like i sound like i have a frog in my throat uh, you know what let me take a drink of my cold brew here all right moving on we have another i think i do believe this is another clinique and this is sugared grapefruit oh laura you're so predictable <laughs> however look at that look at that guys <gasps> look at that i love this one i absolutely love this one why because it's very very sheer very very neutral very very nice <laughs> i don't know i'm gonna keep it i'm gonna keep it um yeah, sh sugared grapefruit i'm gonna keep this one um i know i probably should throw it away after once the move and i just might because that one is an older one okay um wet and wild uh c531c and this is in breeze breeze now this is a frost frosty brown as well uh i do believe it is yes however i think because of the nature see the nature of the brown it, it tends to be deeper than that other one with the pink here i'll put them side by side so you can see what i'm talking about because they're both a frost but see i don't know this one on my lips this looks more natural more like a bomb more like a uh brown balmy nice this looks more i don't know how to explain it it just doesn't look as natural and it's too frosty too too frosty yeah i can even see it from here but uh, i'm gonna keep that brown one because um i do like it okay this is i'm just gonna throw this away alme it's old 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 now like i mean really old um uh, this one was in the shade uh smart shade butter kiss number 80. I see a theme. I see a theme. <laughs> I'm gonna throw it away. It's it's really old, guys. Oh my goodness, I see a theme. Okay, um, let me make sure here. All right, the um, Revlon Ultra 830 Rose. Must have used this a lot. I did use this one. See, this one is pinky but like that wet and wild was very had a white cast that's what i wanted to say with that wet and wild it 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 left like that white cast this one is doesn't do that however this one i can tell you is really old so it's gonna go bye bye yeah <laughs> look at my napkins okay um next um this is something i recently purchased at marshall's this is the anastasia and it is Catherine liquid lipsticks Catherine let me put on this hand and uh, I did like it I did like it. a theme here oh my goodness but I did love this 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 is so nice for a liquid lipstick this is so nice I'm, I'm pretty impressed with Anastasia lipsticks let me know what you guys like uh, in terms of lipstick do you have a favorite color from her do you guys use her like I said, um, me, I would just get whatever I see at Marshalls on sale and if it was MAC or whatever, I don't care. But now that I'm trying Anastasia, I don't know, I'm pretty impressed. Okay, um, these two I recently hauled, ColourPop Fresh uh, Lip Lacquers. I just hauled these for you guys. Um, yeah, uh, one is called Brandy and one is called um uh, speak easy and i was i don't know when i first got them i said oh my gosh and i swatched it on my hand this is brandy because it does feel kind of thick but no 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 once once it sort of dried down a little bit on my lips it felt really good felt like a just like a tinted gloss without the tackiness liked it so that's brandy and this is speak easy very similar but yeah a different tone I like it I like it 
a lot. So, and I got these on sale at Ulta. So those are staying. All right, um, how much more do I have here? Okay, I have this NARS, uh, pen, it's like a pencil. And I got this free, uh, this is like, this is Cruella, I don't even have to look at it, I already know what it is. This is absolutely, this is like my third one that I've gotten like in a sample with points or something like that. And this I love, this I absolutely love like a theme this is just deeper out of all the themes i've had um and that's why i love it and what i like about it it's that it's not drying it's it just feels really 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 good on the lips and i like the way it dries down on my lip i like the color so this is not going anywhere love it love it cruella like i said that's either my second or third um yeah okay this one wet and wild uh Hot Red C540A from Dollar Tree. It's got that pinky. It's a theme. It's a variation of it, right? But that's going bye-bye. I just don't wear it. Okay. This one I got in a gift or something like that. I think it's Kat Von D, I believe it is. Oh my gosh. Mother mother i do believe this is yeah cap um i tried to use this i don't know what it is about it i don't know oh, man. <laughs> it's going bye bye i'm not i'm not even gonna say anything anymore if the pink is is in that shade or it's peachy in that sh same shade I, and i don't wear it i don't wear it i i wear more the peachy ones than the pinky ones <sighs> okay by beauty nori or nor oh, okay i know why i don't wear that one oh yeah yeah very vampy it's nice but i just never wore it good bye bye um let's see which one are you heather i believe this is the one i have on today yeah heather love it <gasps> Going bye bye. Okay. Ah. Regardless, I liked it. Anyway. Okay. So let's talk about this one. This one is called um, Mocha. M O K A. I think I had that one. This one I had on my lips. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Peachy tone. Peachy brown. You see a lot of that peachy coral brown okay we're keeping it i'm not throwing that one away bite beauty uh rhubarb 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 this is a little mini didn't use it pretty absolutely pretty 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 let me see this is too no it's too different that is really nice i'm gonna keep it out and i'm probably gonna throw it away once we move just because it is a little bit on the older side. But I like it. I think I can get a couple more uses or some use out of that one. And then thistle. You've guys seen this thistle. Thistle is something I did use a lot. It's very much that nude, uh, nude lavender. I love it. <laughs> I love this one. You've seen it in some Get Ready With Me. Can I keep it? and probably have to discard it once we move because it is getting old then i have this one from bite beauty which is fig fig and i do remember using this one i did i did use this one it's got the pink the pink shade but it has that shimmer or sheen i like it i like it but I'm gonna throw it away like I said these are the older ones and now that I'm moving I'm just gonna get some use out of, a little bit more use out of those bite beauty ones the little ones um, because those are older all right and I think this is the last one I have which is a Mac which is in velvet Teddy I think it's a cult favorite here almost done with it just gonna use it up keep it I, I think this is like my absolute favorite shade texture 
just everything about this is just this is me right here <laughs> and a lot of people too because um, it is a cult favorite here all right so this one is elf t rose is the color i think this was mom's this is gonna go bye bye this was mom's i believe i found this in her stuff look at that's pretty that's very very pretty not overly pink a mauve that's what it is to me a rosy mauve very nice but I am gonna throw it away because it is old. I do believe that one was mom's. Why do I think that that one was mom's? Okay, now the liners, real quick, because I, I had found that one in the liners. This is a new one for me, Lip Contour Liner. Um, I bought it at Marshall's on sale, and I, why do I think I have a two of these? Invisible Smudge Stopper is what it is. Um, so it doesn't let your lipsticks bleed. It's universal. You can use it whatever, with whatever lipstick. And you could, you can, I swatched it here, and you can feel it like a barrier, like a thick balm barrier. Uh, I like it. I, I don't use it much, and I need to pull it out. So this is definitely going to stay out, and I'm not going to get rid of that. Um, this one is NYX um, lip liner in SPL 801 Auburn. Um, I don't buy a lot of lip liners and you're going to see a theme again in the liners. Um, I just, liners, it's one of those things that I really try to get into. And when I put a liner on, I have a liner on today. When I put a liner on, I actually love the result of it. Like I like it. Like, I think it matters. I think it makes, to me, I think it makes a difference. But I don't know. I'm just one of those people that when it comes to lipsticks, I'm just like, Shh, and go. <laughs> Unlike shadows and things like that. But anyway, I'm going to keep it. It's not going anywhere. This one is another NYX. Um, and this one is in, I don't see a color. Um, but I'll put that here. Along the same lines. A little, little lighter. But along the same lines <laughs> but this one I do use quite a bit quite a bit okay keeping that one then the other one I have from NYX is this one 854 in pale pink and I recently used it in a get ready with me and I do like it it's right here I like it keeping that and then the last one I have well, let me make sure I think it is yeah is this Mac one um, boldly bear, boldly bear. Love it. Oh my God. Do I love that one right there? Very, see, look at all these liners. Very similar, except for that one, pale pink. Uh, and I'm going to keep them all and I'm going to use them. I'm going to use them and I'm going to keep them. And even after the move, but that was everything guys. That was absolutely all of my lipsticks. So we got rid of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. Pretty good, huh? I mean, if I'm not using them and they're not really, you know, and they're all similar in color anyway. <laughs> Anyways, my friends, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me take my glasses off. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are all doing well. And I will see you all in my next declutter, pack, or keep, moving chronicles, makeup edition. How's that? Okay, my friends, talk to you later. Hope you guys are well. See you soon. Bye.